Hello there, and welcome to Silent Hill Origins. This is a uh, prequel, essentially. Though it is considered non-canon by a lot of people, I suppose. Um, but I felt like I wanted to play it anyway. I wanted to get it in there. Because it is the, the, the starting point to the story, essentially. So let's just jump in, shall we? Subtitles, of course, just in case I'm blabbering on. Who did I just pass there? That you, good buddy? Tree top tall and wall to wall. Travis, you messed up son of a bitch. What you doing on my road? Well, hit on a gig, bud. I'm taking the shortcut past Silent Hill. Stopping for coffee as soon as I hit Brahms. I'm beat. Bad dreams still keeping you awake. I told you, man. A girl or two would go a long way. Sleep like a baby with a chicken, your cat. Guess I just don't meet the right girls, bud. Maybe if you weren't always blabbering about Luby and Batman, it's going to be young, but how you don't even remember how why. Hey, chill. You don't see me bringing up your issues. <laughs> no need. My old lady keeps me fully informed of my feelings. The girl keeps notes. You mean she hasn't left you yet? <laughs> Any day now. See you around, Travis. Take it easy. 10-4. Catch you later, buddy. Sensing trouble past. you be Freak you out. Hello. <laughs> huh? Hey, come back. You were in my mirror a second ago. Okay. So I guess we do the old run forwards then, down the foggy road. Um, this is the PS2 version, and we have turned off the noise filter because it, in this one it's particularly intrusive, so we are going without it in this one. So hopefully this is running nice and smooth, so right, let's just do this, shall we? Uh, right, okay. A little beginning credit scene. Interesting. A billboard, you're never alone. With a Hemingway. Is that a cigarette? It certainly looks like it. So we're currently chasing the little girl we saw in the mirror. And then on the road. What happened to the figure that was in the cloak? Not oh, fuck. It's smoke. My God. Who are you? Someone's in there. Okay. And Travis is pretty brave running into a burning building. Just off the cliff. Okay. 
Uh, don't really know. They all look like they're on fire. This one? Seems to work. We'll take it. There's walls of fire everywhere. I see a ring on the floor over here. It looks like the, uh, the old halo of the sun. I remember it well. <laughs> You're coming with me. Strange symbol. Looking at it makes my head hurt. Ah, uh, that old chestnut. Okay, let's uh, check out the controls here a little bit. So we, we can't go down the stairs, we came up. I'm sure. Okay, that, uh, that uh, solves that problem, I think. We'll just take the express elevator down to floor one. This, this, I'm assuming, is a lesser, it's gotta be. Or it's implied. Even though I don't think she was in a house fire. Originally. Unless I'm uh, forgetting vital information here. I know she was burned, but... I could be wrong. Safe now. Kind of. Hey, someone help her. Where is everyone? Oh. Mm -hmm. The siren is calling. Right. Okay. So, house fire, Alessa. Mystery woman. <sighs> I'll be awaken on a bench in the middle of a town we are very familiar with. Where am I? At least recently. Silent Hill. What happened last night? That girl. Did she make it? They would have taken her to the hospital. Coon Street. Okay. I need to see if she's okay. Oh, we've got a map. Right, okay, that's good. Can we not zoom out any? No? Pet shop. Florists. Right, okay, so Alcamilla. We know this place very well. Um, I'm just having a quick look to see if... I recommend, uh, recommend, recognize anywhere. No, I don't. I do kind of, but I don't at the same time. It's probably very similar to Silent Hill 1's layout, though, I would assume. Because Al Camilla is the hospital from Silent Hill 1. We're going to do the normal, and we're going to check for he healthy items. The road is out, it appears. As to be expected. I need to go to the hospital. Better check on that girl. Closing down. Everything must go. 2103. All the codes, like, you see numbers all over the walls and such in these games, and it's always like, should I remember that? Should I remember that? I don't know. Should I? Right, okay. So, I guess if we're gonna have to go... Oh, you have stamina in this one. I actually, uh... Don't like that very much. Right, okay. I'm not seeing anything as of yet. So I don't know if there is actually gonna be any... Sneak. They are large cardboard boxes there. MSG? Right, okay. Found a health drink. Right, okay, so there is items here. That's good to know. This road is also closed. I did play this game a long, long time ago. When it was on PSP. Well, it was on PSP. I think it came out on PS2 around the same time. To be fair. Um, but I, I remember virtually nothing about it, so... 
This fire escape has been sealed off. I feel like this is the fire escape we fought the moth on top of in Silent Hill 1. It kind of feels... Right. Oh, take that. Two health drinks. Just in the beginning section, I like it. Okay. The stamina thing probably is going to annoy me a little bit. Okay, I can't see forwards. You don't have the cool camera. Oh, we can put our dukes up. Okay, so we can actually fight with our fists, which is bizarre. Alright, road out. Like them all. Like all of them. All of the roads. Right, I guess we go inside Al Camilla then. Let's do this, I suppose. Map. I will always take a map. If there is an option to take a map, I will take a map. Well, so we can kind of zoom in there, it looks like. A note as well, public notice. Under construction, currently the second and third floors of the hospital are undergoing renovations. At this time, they are closed to patients and visitors. Work continues in earnest, and the hospital management thanks you for your continued cooperation as we try to minimise disruption. We estimate the construction will be completed within six months. The restructuring of the third floor will almost double our capacity for inpatients and introduce cleaner, more modern facilities. Here at Alcamilla, the quality of care we provide to you, our valued patient, is of the utmost importance. Dr. Phillips, chairman of the Alcamilla board. Right, okay. Third floor we were able to access. In fact, there was four floors technically, if we remember correctly. Uh, TV looks a bit sus. I'm assuming this is going to be the save point for this game. A weird triangle with an eyeball on it. Maybe we should chuck a save in, just to kind of christen the game a little bit. Okay. Success. At least it doesn't blind you with redness like uh, Bree did. Okay. Things are locked, naturally. I mean, like always, it's good to check everything and keep them... Uh, locked off. I do prefer the map zoomed out. Toilets. Everything is locked. We did have a brief moment of music then that <laughs> left us immediately. I can't leave until I know what happened to the girl. Oh, it's back. It's locked. Something's blocking it, I can't open it. Everything is locked. Seems jammed, I can't open it. Hey, you a doctor? Can I help you? That fire last night. The girl who was burned. Is she here? A girl? We've received no new patients in the last day or so. Was she hurt? She was burned all over. Are you a relative? What did you say her name was? I don't know her name. I was the one who saved her from the fire. She must have been brought here. Is there another hospital? I'm sorry. Perhaps someone in reception could help you. I have urgent business to attend to. Goodbye. Bye-bye. It's very Kauf Kaufman-esque. I wonder who he's supposed to be then. Unless it is him, it might be him. Um, I guess we got the lift. All of these are locked. He's gone to two. Right, okay. A dirty gurney. Someone just left it here? It wasn't in here when he entered the lift, was it? Maybe it was. Three is uh, under construction. Okay. We do have a light on us immediately, I like that. No having to run through a mall to find it. First monster. Yes. Excuse me, miss. You okay? She does not look okay. Oh god. Hammer? I'm gonna punch her if I can. I can. Take this! It's 
Ramones, and I don't like doing this, but you're a monster. Oh, she's dead. It's alright. We got a hammer. Um, the aggressive music is fairly loud here. Uh, right, okay. Um, no, 206. Somebody's blocking it, I can't open the door. 205, that seems to be the only option. Hello? <laughs> Medicine cabinet full of drugs I don't recognise. This gurney is stained with blood, some of it still seems wet. Disgusting. Medical charts, they mean nothing to me. What are you? Alcamella Hospital. Uh, preliminary diagnosis. Third degree burns patient is unconscious. Something has prevented damage spreading to the internal organs. Tissue damage is limited to the epidermis and extremities of limbs. How is this possible? Because she has powers, my friend. Because she has powers. Something wrong with the mirror. The reflection isn't right. Yeah, it looks pretty dirty there. Uh, we're about to be introduced to something uh, only this game does. Uh, a bunch of medical pamphlets. Tropical diseases, baby vitamins, or vitamins, depending on where you're from. Flu shots, that kind of stuff. Right, okay. Spooky child. Okay. So yeah, this is this ver this game's version of the transition between other world and that. Fire. How did you? And just like that, poof. We're not in the same place anymore. Seeing things. This ain't right. I actually like this. I think this is interesting. Like it's like a mirrored reality. What the heck? Some lungs here. I do remember this much, being able to travel between. Got a pair of lungs out of a box then, by the way. Uh, so yeah, we can get back here, but there's no point to be- what the- Was that on the floor before the blood? I don't know if it was. Maybe stuff does change. Right, okay. Mirror world. There's something sticking out of the bed there, it looks like. Scalpel. Alright, so we've got a pair of lungs. Not that I remember what to do with them, but we do have them. A health drink. Uh, maybe we should equip a weapon, or should I just fight the nurses in hand-to-hand -hand combat? Um, maybe we should put a weapon on, I reckon. It's a good idea to save some, I think, but maybe we'll... Uh, I need to find them, first of all, would be a good show. Supplies. Melee. Right. Let's put the scalpel on. Stainless steel, like, yeah. So you can get multiple weapons, but as far as I remember, I think they're, they're durability based, so we've got to be a bit weary about how you use them. Oh, I see you. Get out of my sight, you villain. The scalpels seem pretty effective. I just stabbed her in the butt. It's probably didn't like that very much. door seems jammed. I didn't even know it was a door, to be fair. I can't open the door. Something's blocking here. I can't open the door. Okay. So we've got- it shows you where the portals are. Right, intensive care. Nurse centre. So we've only got a few places to check, I think. I feel like I'm hearing- Okay, the background noise is all just as scary. Lock's broken. Everything's jammed. They do have giant locks on them, so I don't even know what I'm checking, but... You never know. Somebody's blocking it. So you can kind of control the camera a little bit, but not as much as I'd like. Oh, we can go through here. Maybe we should check the rest of the floor first. Right. Jammed. Locking. Open. Is this where we came from? Am I being a dummy? I am being a dummy. Right, 
Okay. So it's down here we want to be checking out. So nurse center on the right. Yeah, so we can get to the stairwell. Oh. Hello? What are you? Are you a... Worry... Uh, right, okay. Parts of this note are obscured. Worry not. Blank, 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 blank. I have used the blank to contain her power. No one will come to her aid. Blank, 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 blank. One of the five blank. Hide them. Protect them. Blank. Okay. Golden egg. Delicious. Right, um, okay. There's just hunks of flesh on the floor here. Oh, radio. Oh, nurse. Oh, Dell, Travis. Right, chill. Okay, it's not letting me do the old stomp a -rooney. Oh. Okay, we'll just let it get back up then, Travis. It's fine. Okay, we got it that time. Get out of my sight. Okay. Something's making noise over here. Lock's broken. A portable TV. Bit random. Oh, this door opens. Oh, it sounds awful in here. Oh, there's a cooler. Uh, this heart of mine troubles me with its trembling. To still it, I have to put it on ice and lock it away. Remember, the three beauties who cause it to pump so are the key. Age before beauty. Age before beauty, what do you mean? It's a medical ice box with a lock. Take a look. I guess. Um. Okay. Okay, so I'm guessing we're going to get another set of organs out of there, potentially. But we're gonna have to go and f Right, they've got incredibly noisy in here. There's, the nurse is dead, chill out. Okay, downstairs we go, I suppose. Anything under the stairs? Can't see anything, it won't let me change the camera either. I hear spooky things. There you are. A lunch for me, please. I'll take care of you. Uh-oh. I think broke. There's no, like, uh... Alcohol ball. Kind of interesting. I'm finding a load of stuff that I don't know what to do with. Listen, go down please, and then I can, uh... Yeah, there we go. We'll take care of this. What the heck is that? That's a crazy looking door. There is a death mask on the door. Underneath is a plaque that retreats. Even the blind have need for eyes if they wish to gaze at the future. Okay. Uh, this certainly looks like it could be egg related. <laughs> Just saying. Uh, this is broken anyway. Maybe we have to use that there. Um, so it'll be in items, maybe. A lucky quarter. I've had this quarter since I was a kid, from when my parents died. It's kind of a lucky charm. It has something scratched onto it. It looks like a 61. What's that even mean? Warm to the touch, this egg is larger than a hen's and has an oily shine to it. Plastic organ is a replica... Of a set of human lungs, right? Okay. Egg, kind of reasonable, I think. Right, let's just check the map just to make sure we've checked all the options here. We haven't checked whatever that is, nor can we, I don't think. Unless that is what that door is, potentially. Yeah, because that one's blocked. Hello. There's a mirror. Which means maybe we can get into the normal world there. Right, okay. 
Okay, I'm seeing this. Oh, there is some kind of weird code here. Inside Stevie, little Henry lurks. Right, okay. So, this is a hint. Having trouble with your anatomy class, find that getting them out is much easier than getting them in. Just remember this easy mnemonic. Uh, inside Stevie, little Henry lurks. So, intestines, stomach, liver, heart, lungs. Right, okay. I'm going to have to reread that at some point, no doubt. Um... So we need to find a set of organs for something. Uh, nothing to see, just a filthy toilet. Gross! Right, okay, I guess we can go through the mirror then. I think that's a really interesting mechanic. It makes you have, like, two versions of the same hospital to look through, essentially. Amy 31. Right, okay, let me just write that down quickly. Very, very quickly. If I can find my pen. Right. A me 31, right, okay. So it said age before beauty, right? So it's just going to be the ages, I would assume. But we were probably going to have to mess around with that a little bit. Staff room, right, staff lounge key. That's good. Well, I hope it's good. There might be monsters in there, which is bad, so. Now it's unlocked, right, okay. This side of the hospital's got to be safer, surely. Right, okay, did we see one that was... So, staff lounge is behind us. Through the double doors. Here, I think. Alright, oh, cool. Yeah, there's a lot of stuff here. Someone's been on the Hemingways again there, it looks like. Right, there's a note. Construction, as you know, the renovations to the upper floors have run into problems. The plumbing, leak, and substandard materials used have forced us to close off the third floor until further notice. We are reminded of the familiar adage, you get what you pay for. We now face six more months of work, reducing our capacity for the coming year. We will have to cut spending on inpatient care uh, and consultancy fees by 50%. Therefore, we ask doctors to refrain from committing patients and encourage home stays instead. Unless they are dying in your arms, don't book them in. Staff party. Worry not, the staff party is still on. Our recreation budget is locked away where no one can tamper. Everyone meets at Annie's bar at 8pm on Friday. Alcohol. Medicinal, of course. And food will be free. Arrive early to grab a trainee nurse. They go quick. Uh, just old textbooks, reports, and magazines. Nothing I need. The thing is, everything... An energy drink. Okay, well, that might be something to do with the stamina there. Let me just have the coffee right there. Someone's been here recently. Aha! There's a new thing. It says Lucy23. Right, okay. Write that one down, too. Because my memory is so bloody awful. Right. Lucy23. Right, okay. Cool, cool, cool. Then. We can... Obviously the phone's not going to work, is it? Is there anything else in here? I feel like there should be something else in here. Door seems jammed. Right, okay. Right, so we've got two numbers, or two uh, ages, sorry. But now what? I feel like we missed something in that room, I don't know though. Right, we can't go up the stairs. Exam room. To be, we didn't get anything for the exam room, did we? The exam room's another key. Ah, there's something there. Interesting. Right, okay. I got a toaster. That's not what I was looking at, but I will take it. Got the exam room key. So yeah, you can use almost anything as a weapon, it seems. Um. Yeah, we've got TV. Alcohol bottle. Toaster. I don't know what the plus means, though. Maybe the, there's... I don't know, because, like, obviously that breaks. I don't really understand it. We will figure it out, though, I guess. Um, right, okay, so we can go to the exam room now. Even the normal world sounds a little bit spooky. Right, there's no point in going the exit, we'll go this way. I will get my bearings soon enough. Uh, right, okay, exam room, where are thou? Oh, through here. Right, cool. We will have this whole hospital. There's the body that I've got to put things in, I assume. I see you. I see you there. Alcohol bottle. 
if I'm correct, isn't this where Lisa was waiting? Some things in the sink there, what are they? Plastic stomach. Plastic intestine. That kind of looked like a brain for a second there. Sarah19, I see you there. You little sneaky sausage. Right, okay, maybe we can actually get into that thing now. Um, uh, Sarah... 19. So you would think it's, what do you say, age before beauty? So oldest to youngest. So it would be 31, 23, 1, 9. So 3, 1, 2, 3, 1, 9. Potentially, if I've looked into that correctly. Right, okay. Um, so we can go back there now. Yeah, but first, can we check any of this stuff out? Probably not. Door's broken. Right, okay, so what do we have for this body at the moment? Uh, I'm pretty sure we don't have everything we need. This is a little bit confusing, the uh, menus on this one. Right, lungs, stomach, intestine. So we need uh, liver and heart, I think. None of which I know where they are. Typewriter. <laughs> okay, notice. To all staff, it is forbidden to enter my office unaccompanied until further notice. Dr. Kaufman. Okay. He smokes a lot, it looks like. Look at that bin. It's full of cigarettes. Uh, medical books, nothing about the ordinary. The door is sealed. I can't get through. Indeed it is. Right, okay. So, we've got to go back to the heart box, I would assume. Um, I was debating putting a quick save in there, but... We'll uh, find the heart first, at the very least. Right, okay, so... The quickest... we would probably go through the portal and then go back up the stairs, I reckon. It's probably the best way of doing it. Though there may be a few more monsters around these days. Did I check the stalls in this... This version? I can't remember if I did. I must have done. Dirty toilets. Disgusting. Uh, I forgot how noisy it was back here. Um, door on the left. Right, okay, we've got the stairs. And then it's the door left and at the end on the corridor. Still chilling? Cool. Okay. Let's see if this works. Right, so we are 31, 23, 1, 9. Right, 3, 1, 2, 3, 1, 9. Beautiful. Now we've got a plastic, disgusting heart. Where's the liver at? Um. Oh my god, you just actually scared the poop out of me. You were dead on the floor, I saw you. You can't take me, I'm... Bunchy McBuncherson. Okay, so where have we missed 201? Or something, wasn't it? Oh no, the door is jammed. <laughs> Okay. So as far as I'm aware... Is this like the... This... I'm confused. Okay, so we can check the decayed version. Hmm. Okay. I don't know where to go then, really. Where would the stomach be? Hmm. I genuinely don't know. Maybe we can go and put these in and then it unlocks something, potentially. We're going to discussing... Yeah, the music seems to come at you at random intervals, it seems. Throws me off guard every time. Oh my god! Listen, you need to stop sneaking up on me like that. I don't like that random enemies appear in random rooms, it seems like.
feel like I'm feeling slightly jumpy today. Sometimes it lets you step on them, but sometimes it doesn't. I'm gonna have to take her out, otherwise she'll just get me later. I'm so glad it gives you an option to use hand to hand, though. I think maybe she's just in an awkward spot, potentially. Listen, lady. I've got stuff to do. Oh, God, I didn't realise this was a thing. Yeah, stay dead this time, please. Thank you. And the other body's still there. This just means there's been another one. Okay, did we check the toilets? I can't remember. Are you... Oh, let's see. Did we just check them in the open world? I can't remember. Oh, the system lid's loose. Right, okay. There's the liver. Right, okay. That makes a whole lot more sense now. Okay, so now we've got to go back and do that thing. Alright, cool. And then we leave. Is that an energy drink on the floor I just saw there? It could well be. It seems to be. Right, I'll take it. I'm missing so much. Right, okay. So we need to go back to that cadaver kind of thing. The fake body malarkey. Right, hello. Inside Stevie, little Henry lurks, was it? Yes. So, intestines, uh, stomach... Inside Stevie, little liver, heart, lungs. Yeah, because that's not creepy. What, what now? Oh, we can take the eyes. Oh, the eyes. Okay. I get it. I get it. I get it. Right, because we're going to go and put the eyes in that door. Okay, creepy, creepy. Right, I am going to leave the episode here, though, because we've been running on for just a few minutes. Um, I hope you've enjoyed this so far. If you have, like and subscribe. Click that little bell icon if you want updates as and when new episodes come out. I'll see you next time. Bye for now.